a Wikividi Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Pakistani Senate Election, 2018 The triennial Senate elections of Pakistan were held on 3 March 2018 to replace 52 retiring senators half of the Senate's strength, with the winning candidates serving six-year terms. Overall, Pakistan Muslim League came out as the largest party, followed by the Pakistan People's Party and the Pakistan Tariqi and Safe. Prior to this election, PML candidates were declared as independents by the Election Commission of Pakistan owing to a Supreme Court judgment. Background On 28 July 2017, the Supreme Court of Pakistan disqualified Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif from holding public office. Following this, the Elections Act 2017 was passed, which allowed Sharif to serve as party head despite being disqualified. However, in a later judgment passed by the Supreme Court on 21 February 2018, Sharif was disqualified from holding office as party president. In this judgment, all decisions taken by Sharif during his tenure as party president were declared null and void, including Senate tickets which he had signed himself to prevent a delay in Senate elections. The Election Commission of Pakistan declared all PML candidates as independents. Voting Voting is conducted on the basis of single transferable vote where the candidates prioritize their vote among a list of candidates. First priority votes are given the highest weightage and carry 100 points. Election Commission of Pakistan establishes the criteria for the minimum number of points required to attain a Senate seat. During the first count, when a candidate breaches that criteria, they are declared a winner for the seat. Any surplus points they have are divided among other preferences in successive iteration. Similarly, a candidate who falls well short of this criteria during the first count has their points transferred among other preferences in subsequent count. This whole exercise is repeated iteratively until all vacant seats are filled. It is pertinent to mention that the points system is only used for senators to be elected from general, women, and technocrat seats in provincial assemblies. For senators who are elected from the National Assembly or are running for a minority-slash-non-Muslim seat in the provinces, only a vote count is used. In a typical election, a total of 52 seats are contested, of which 33 are general seats, 9 are technocrat seats, 8 are women's seats, and 2 are minority seats. Voting Requirements the following table outlines the voting requirements in the current Senate elections. The minimum votes required column only considers first priority votes. Only members from FATA are eligible to vote. Minority seats are filled for only two provinces in a given election. This way the elections for these seats alternate between Punjab slash Sindh and Balochistan slash KPK. Summary Overall, PML-backed independents won the most seats, securing 15 of the 52 seats up for election. Eleven of these seats were in Punjab, two of them from Islamabad and two from Khyber Pakhtunkhwa. The Pakistan People's Party closely trailed behind, securing 12 of the 52 seats. Of these, 10 were won in Sindh and two were won in Khyber Pakhtunkhwa. Meanwhile, Pakistan Tariqi and Safe secured six seats of which five came from Khyber Pakhtunkhwa and one from Punjab. The strong performance of the PPP raised many eyebrows and led to allegations of horse trading by the party, noting that MQM, despite having 52 MPAs in the Sindh Assembly, only managed to secure one senator, whilst the PPP managed to secure two senators from Khyber Pakhtunkhwa with only seven MPAs. Another surprise win was by Chauri Sawar of Pakistan Tariqi and Safe from a general seat in Punjab by gaining 44 first priority, two seconds priority votes the most in the assembly. This was a surprise as the result came about despite the PTI-PML alliance only having 38 votes. This indicated that Sawar had also been voted for by members of Pakistan Muslim League and Pakistan People's Party. Brought to you by Wikividi Documentaries. Would you like to know more?